Hey, Island Lakes here with your monthly real estate market report for the month of February 2023. Stephen Alona, Green Max Performance Realty. And we're going to go over what is sold in February versus January. And as we go throughout the year, we're going to look at these numbers and uh, um, and it'll make a lot more sense to you as we get further down into the year. We're also going to take a look at the month of February for the previous five years and see what sales look like then. So as we take a look at February, there were six sales and uh, 29 listings, uh, giving you 4.5 months of inventory. So that's uh, into the balanced market territory. Um, a balanced market is anywhere from four to six months worth of inventory. Six months and beyond becomes a buyer's market. And before four months, it is an active seller's market. So you can see you had six and a half more months of inventory getting into a uh, basically a buyer's market there, but it has changed. And again, you can't look at just one month for your months of inventory. And as we go throughout the year, you're going to see how this is going to change. And, and you'll see the it'll all make sense to you when we're going through. Average sale price was actually $700,000. Well, that was based off of four sales. So if you have four or three houses that were higher price houses itself, or even one very high price house in the highest price house in the neighborhood or something like that, that can really affect your numbers there. So 493 is uh, what the average selling price is right now, basically almost 494 and uh, 34 days on the market versus 14 days. So it'll be interesting to see as you go on um, how many days on the market it is. So let's now pop over and take a look at what the average sale price was. And you can see 2022 was a phenomenal year. And this is kind of the norm that we're seeing that it just from 19, 20, 21, they kind of going up, going up little bits, little bits at a time. And that's the way Winnipeg usually is. And then there was a huge spike in 2022. And again, you could have had just a few houses that sold in, you know, a couple higher price ones that jumped that price up, just like January um, last month when we look at it was where... But as you take a look at this is what we're starting to see. This this 2023 price is, is still now getting more into what the 2021 and the 2020 numbers were. But if you're looking to sell your house or you are looking at buying a particular house, let's do a longer period of time where we pull the data out for you, help you out with some information and uh, and, and let, you, let you become an informed buyer, an educated buyer, educated seller, whatever it may be. If you have any real estate related questions, reach out to us. Let's have a conversation. We'd love to chat with you. We'd love to talk real estate with you. We'd love to show you what the market is doing and what you can expect. Thanks for watching. Tune in again next month for our next monthly report. And if you like our content, subscribe to our YouTube channel, uh, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, give us a Google reviews. Google reviews help us out so much. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.